hey guys welcome back to the channel again it's your girl faith ae you know the vibe already actually i don't know why i'm so excited today maybe it's because my voice is gradually coming back together and also talking to you guys but anyway i'm so happy today if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is faith ae in case you don't know and trust me you're gonna like it here you're gonna love it here anyway if you do love it don't forget to click on the red button over there the subscription button over there and like comment and also subscribe of course when i know you guys is going to enjoy this video and you guys is gonna love this channel and always to come back if you're my returning subscriber you are welcome to this channel thank you for always coming back thank you for always checking out i really appreciate you guys yes so in today's video you already know what we're going to do today because of the title and the tummy so that's what we're going to be doing today how to create a youtube intro a cute girl youtube intro game on track yes so it's going to be interesting and also don't forget to follow me on my socials my tiktok i normally post a lot there on my tiktok and my instagram i recently just started to post recent things on my instagram so also check out my instagram i'm gonna put all the link at the description box below there so you're gonna check it out and so guys that's it without further ado let's get into the video we are in the cap cup already and now we need to go to um google and type pink aura yeah pink aura is gonna be fine it's gonna give us this cute background while we type it so we need to scroll down we're looking for this particular one yes so you can actually save it if you want to but i don't think i'm gonna save it because i have it there yeah so let's go back to the cap cut and yeah and let's click on new project new project we have different one yeah so i just have to click on the one i save let's click on it and drag it to seven seconds because uh it's gonna be longer a little bit but not too long and yeah it's in seven or six seconds but i leave mine in seven seconds so once we're done with this one let's just go back to editing and in editing we're going to find some ratio and click on 16 now i think that's the youtube size but still it's not fitting so let's drag it so it's going to fit the screen there's a green line there that's going to just that's going to tell you what to do when to stop yeah so i think that is it here yeah. so let's add our first picture what we need to do is to go back to setting and click on overlay you can see the overlay button there so we click on it and scroll down i've caught all this one already but i'm not going to tell you now i think it's going to be later but let's use the original so you can see the way i caught it out in her so i click on the original which is this one over here i don't really have a lot of photos so i'm going to manage this five photo yet so we need to drag it to seven seconds so it's going to the background and the timing you know get what i'm trying to say here so we have this for already there we need to go to cut hard in the editing aspect and then cut out where is cut out let's look for cut out yeah. yes in cut out we have erase background and you're going to click on the erase background let's click on it and yeah so this is the erase background so we've removed the background already but let me confirm if it's actually the same thing i did so let's check the previous the original video oh yeah it's actually the same thing so let's go back to cap cut and uh we need to go to mask now and in mask uh let's click on film straight over there and rotate it make sure you rotate it and make sure everything is in the middle so let's try to keep it straight you get what i'm trying to say and leave it in 91 degree minus 91 degree sorry to say so we're gonna leave it in minus nine so the next thing to do is to go to mask let's look for mask and editing and click on things filter in filter it will give us this background and yeah i think the background there's nothing much going on here so we'll leave it in filter so let's go back to editing and click on effects so click on the video he fits not the body inventing scratching spark where there is spark there so let's move it to spark and it's spark let's click on um spark 2 yeah let's click on spark 2 so it's gonna give us this effect so yeah we have this one yes so that is it let's check if it's actually the same thing with the original yes it's the same thing. that's what i use i thought that's not what i use so so yeah we're in the right spot yeah 
and make sure we always expand it to the seven seconds so it's gonna fit with the timing so you get what i'm trying to say so that's just it let's expand it and make sure it's actually in the right sense and we need to cut it out to free you wondering why i'm doing this so that once the timing in the first section is over the second one will continue let's see yes so that's what i'm trying to say and that is it we need to have a cute butterfly but what we need to do is to go to editing and we have stickers and the stickers we need to click on the love icon and click on the butterfly you need to see the moving butterfly there so let's just click on it and um let's uh, mirror it so wait a minute okay that is actually what i did yes so that's what the let's mirror the butterfly and yeah so we actually duplicate the butterfly make it to be two and mirror that's it <laughs> it's so easy yeah so drag it to the seven seconds as usual this is what i got so let's go to effect and in effect uh we click on retro in retro let's click on retro yeah we can find blue edge electronic and we'll click on blue edge electronic it's going to give us this kind of effect which is actually vibing yeah as usual seven seconds so that what i did yes so so let's go to editing and in editing we'll find um we'll find overlay and click on overlay because one had two photos i'm gonna show you guys i actually caught my photos there so yeah so this are the photos i caught already i'm going to use it uh okay let me just use the old one so what i did is to go to my app the app i have which is magic chords and in magic chords where is it let me just type in magic magic eraser yeah so in our magic in eraser i just have to pick some photos here the one I haven't caught before and place it there so it's gonna read uh, it's gonna erase all the background get what i'm trying to say so that's it this is the original and this is the way the two photos um came so let's go to cap cut and in cap cut let's just pick this one because i've caught it out already so i'm gonna come back and pick the rest but yeah let's do this first um shift it to the side and yeah it's in the side already but um mirror the photos mine is actually facing the left side so i need to mirror it you get what i'm trying to say so this is how make it bigger try to make it perfect let's check it's kind of smaller yes take it down a little bit yeah that's it so let's go back to editing and click on overlay so we can have the second photo scroll down yeah I'm, I'm just looking for the second photo you get what i'm trying to say so yeah i got it this way so i just have to click on it and add so we have it already we just have to make it bigger and yes yeah, so i'm just trying to make sure that everything is okay so let's go back to the original and um yeah in the original yeah that is how it is but the medium one looks smaller so let's adjust it a little bit oh uh, yeah i think it's perfect i think it's perfect now it's okay yeah so let's reduce it later so yeah we're done with this so let's go to test add test and i'm gonna put down my name faith ehi so i'm gonna put down my name okay so yes fifth a here and i'm gonna use um this uh font size i'm gonna use junk wide junk wide and i'm just gonna put it down a little bit and effects i'm gonna use let's click on effects and use pink pink you see pink side at the then I click on pink and the pink i'm using this pro map this pro option but if you can't use this pro option there are other free version there so that's it and now we also need to do the same to the other name because we're also going to type two name here yeah? let's go to test and add faith a he but a uh, faith a he so this time around we're gonna use some signature we're looking for signature signature yeah yes we found you so we're just gonna use some effects and 
wait, hold on a sec we're gonna use the same effect so that's why i click and uh drag it i want to be a little bigger i don't want it to be smaller is that what i did so i'm just checking so we just have to put it in the rightful position and make sure it's actually okay so this is what we have but we need to go to ammunition the first one the fifth air, the bigger one we're going to use uh a normal popping we're going to use the popping one and the signature i'm just using the shiny aspect there so that's how we got this one and this is the look for now so this is how it is for now yes i think it's giving the vibe now the second one i just used the other flitter one so it to be okay so now let's go on to edit and click on amination in amination we have different options but i'm looking for the one that says side right and side left because i want the two photos there to be left and right you get what i'm trying to say so this one the first one is going to side right and the second one is going to side left and together this is how everything is going to look yes so perfect now we move on to the second part of this composition <laughs> like this intro yeah it's not difficult but it's actually difficult but yeah so we'll go to safari and in safari we let me check yeah in safari we just have to type in pink pen pink pen so it's gonna give us a lot of cute pink pen and i have a lot of option and the next one we need to type in is pink ipad and so we have a lot of pink ipad frame here it's okay or any ipad frame so i decided to click on this one because i still need to remove the background and I have my transparent frame you get what i'm trying to say so let's save it i actually used the magic eraser to remove it so now we've actually saved everything we need in the um option one like in the page one and now so we need to save it and save it in a high quality and yeah we need to make sure we save it in a high quality make sure it will give us a good video once we've actually downloaded it on sorry uploaded it on youtube you get what i'm trying to say so now in the second one all the stuff we've actually all the stuff we actually downloaded we need to click on new project and start bringing the one after the other but for the at the moment i don't want a lot of things to be going on in my in my laptop home screen you get what i'm trying to say so i have to take off everything i use on the first one take off the sparkle the effects just the cars i just need a background and that is the only thing i need so let's take them out we just take trying to take everything out get out so now we have everything let me make sure that nothing is missing yeah so now we have it then click on overlay and in overlay we just look for the first the video actually i'm using video two video precisely so we're just gonna click on the video and uh this is the first video i'm still gonna click on the second video but for now we just need to adjust this one and code it to be seven seconds but it's not actually gonna be seven seconds so let's actually have this second video and this is the second video the both of them for now is gonna be on seven seconds then we can know how to how to adjust it a little bit so this is it and now we need to add the the frame make sure you click on overlay make sure you click on overlay to add anything it's gonna fit in perfectly instead of going to the normal one it's gonna turn to background once you go to the normal adding so this is my videos let's adjust it and make sure uh we're just trying to make sure it's fitting the screen and this is the difficult part i was trying to tell you guys like it's actually so difficult to put fit in the screen my frame is um transparent because i actually erased the background with the magic eraser so i my video can be showing you get what i'm trying to say so it can look like a real ipad so i'm just trying to make sure that the timing of the video is okay let's divide the video 
so we've actually caught the midu and make it to be three and a half seconds and three and a half seconds and go to overlay and had the remaining stuff which is the ipad to get this ipod uh sorry the iphone we got to safari and in safari what i did was to um type in the pink iphone plg but it's actually difficult to find so plg pink iphone 12 and yeah this is how i got my pink eye for trade and i just erased the background and yeah so i'm not going to save it because i have it already add and yes so this is it i have it here we're just trying to adjust it is that what i did in the original sorry i guess i'm just trying to check so we need to adjust it a little bit what we need to do now is to go to instagram because we need to record our instagram own page and everyone has screen record on their phone you just have to click on it and screen record you don't have to you don't need to make it with duty you get what i'm trying to say you just have to screen record and now let's go back to the cap cup and what we just record and had remember overlay first and had and rotate and put it on the side is that what i did let's check so yeah i think that's it just have to make it to be smaller and yeah so that is it we need to go to split and take out some parts out and put the main part this is when you need some detailing so we just need to cut it split and cut split and cut you get what i'm trying to say so adjust it so it's gonna be like this this eye is gonna look yeah so well done this is how this part look like but a lot of things going on with this instagram is too obvious like the opacity is just too much so let's go to mask and in mask we click flitter and it's going to be like this i think i like it this way now and yeah this is it this is how it looks like yeah so guys just one thing i did i went to overlay and click on stock video and in stock video here we have the white and the black background so i added the white one and let's go to mask i went to mask let's go to mask and click on circle and adjust it a little bit it's gonna end up like this just i just like an oval shape so now i need to go to overlay and add some folds you know the photos are caught already actually i'm going to show you guys that how oh, i've showed you guys already so now we need a different folds so i added this one and go to cut out where's my cut out i want to remove the background yes so remove background so i need to adjust it a little bit so it to be bigger is that what i did let's check yes so we need to make it to be bigger a little bit and come down yes so that is what is going on here let's see if so now we need to go to test template in the test option and click on messages and the message we have different templates and we are going to click on this one so we double tap it this place the the road lara is it we're just going to remove it and write insta click take it out and write insta because we want to be kind of um kind of okay you get what i'm trying to say so in cute so write insta and just leave it there so now we need to go to the test option and type in my name fave uh, he wait how did i do it again um okay so i actually put on the fade and the hair is gonna be underneath the fade and i for the font one i actually use cute funny cute yes yeah, so i use funny cute and went to pink and in pink i put the normal one as usual the normal effect that we normally use the pro one and then i went to oh, where is it so the pro one so now let's take it up. I don't even know why I want to put it here, but I think it's cute anyway. So um, the next thing we need to do is to go to effect. Um, yeah, we need to go to effect and click the auto typing effect and use the pink one there. So I think yeah, I like it this way. 
so that's the one i use what's the name again or uh well anyway that's it you can say it there so what i did was to adjust it i don't want it to start from the beginning and i went to audio effects and click on typing and we click it on the mouse one we have the first one the second one is two and the third one is long we need to click on the long one the one that says typing long so it's going to give us this this effect like this yeah so that's the effect it's gonna give us i actually like it a lot so that is it so the next thing we're going to do is to aminate this photos here what i did was to you know you see the angular shape over there so i'll click on it once and the other one is zooming then the other one is going to um be at the left it's gonna be left to right to left to right so that's what i did and yes so we need to click on laminate and in laminate i just click on anyone you can put anyone there it's gonna fit in and it's gonna be okay too um and always make sure to save it in high quality and yeah so we save and it's gonna be on her gallery or her photos anyone so yeah this is it and the next thing we need to do which is actually the last one here is to take out everything here because we have the other one there so we just have to take out this because i need the background just the background in this one i need nothing else than the background so i'm just taking everything out the butterflies the stickers everything i need the background let's see if we yeah enter just out so yeah so everything now is actually blank in it we'll take this one out too we're taking everything out guys it's not compulsory you take them out if you want to you can actually um also you can also put the background if you want to but for me i'm taking it out so what i did next is to go to canva if you don't have canva you actually need canva but that's why i normally used to edit so i went to some templates that have four slide i went to this one part because it has four my taste yeah so i took out the photos here yeah, and got to replace photo and i deleted this one i went to replace photos and add my own photo there so i'm just looking for any photo like i said i'm going to be using one part sorry three photos there so the same photo because i've caught this already so when i place it here it's going to be black or white but anyway it's going to be black or white so we just have to delete everything in the template and add my own stuff that's what i'm doing here um we just i'm just trying to place everything together so it's actually gonna look neat and fine <laughs> yeah so i click on this one yeah this one is actually giving the vibe yeah mm, yeah it's fine and the other one have to take it here this is actually not difficult to be honest here it's just for us to place it to the, at the right foot side and uh find the last photos because i need four one and yeah boom, 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 boom. we have it but this one i'm gonna rotate it to the left like sorry flip it to the left <laughs> i'm gonna flip this one to the left and the other one to the right is gonna face each other like left right left right you get what i'm trying to say and once we're done with this one let's adjust this one the hand is kind of it's raising up yeah so then we click on save and we save it and that is it it's gonna be on her gallery or her photos and yeah we move to CapCut, and once we just save on canva we need to go to overlay and had it there it's gonna be there so we just have to find it to me i have it already so i just have to look for it and click so it's gonna be something like this and put on seven seconds and boom that is it and yeah <laughs> so the next thing we need to do is to go to blend and blend into the shape blend filter and that's what i did here so the next is to go to test and pull down my name faith uh faith a he yes i'm not breaking anything i'm not breaking the hair -E. i'm not gonna put it underneath so i just have to use it and go to fonts uh okay in fact it's still going to be the normal one the number pro one that we normally use so that is it 
uh yeah so for the font size is it the font one okay let's use the sparkle as the ammunition part yeah the sparkle is actually nice giving the vibe for the font we're going to use signature i'm looking for signature where are you oh where is my signature yes i find it so this is my signature we'll just put it on seven seconds and boom that's it so we need to adjust it make sure it comes down but if you want to put it on top you can actually put it on top but for me i'm putting it on i'm trying to make sure i don't forget anything oh yeah i almost forget about this parkour stuff then we need to go to effect and effect click on but so not body effect video effect and click on spark and the normal one we normally use pack two and where is this pack it's pack two and click on it it's gonna give us this one and duplicate it to three no actually we need to duplicate to two because it's actually not long it's just seven seconds so this is it it's gonna boom one and uh boom two so that is it and the last one is to put the butterflies and go to stickers love in stickers then we'll click on the love icon there and my mirror the the butterflies and duplicate it and um put one here and put one over there and yes that is it and we just have to frame it to be there <laughs> save it to the high quality and we're done with it and yeah we have our video boom <laughs> so that is it so guys the last thing we're gonna do here is to click on new project and everything we've saved before we just have to bring them in one after the other um just to save them uh, we've saved them already so just to put them in as a new project and yeah this is the first one and the first one yeah it's actually cute and this the second one and the third one boom yeah so this is everything we did earlier it's actually cute in it so so the last one is going to be the transition between the two parts like we're going to use any transition but for now i think we're going to use um popping and pop out something like that or the rotating aspect but yeah you can actually use any one you want to use but for now this is the one i used yes yeah, so i actually used popping one so save it to on high quality and make sure it's gonna be in high quality so it's gonna be used uh it's gonna look okay and clear like the quality is gonna be perfect so this is it and yeah so everything together is gonna be like this the transition and the transition is gonna be like this everything the angular shape <laughs> it's really giving the i think it's cute anyway so what did you think and yeah if you also want to add the music to it you can actually just click on hold you and add your music and be mindful of copyright music copy free music i'm not going to put any sound here because i'm i don't want any i don't want the video to be copyright you know what i'm trying to say but i don't even know if it's going to be copyright so i'm just trying to be careful so that's it so guys i hope you guys really enjoyed the video so that's everything i know that's why i shared the ig together and i also hope that you guys really learned for it and understand the process i know the process this is going to be tricky sometimes but yeah that is everything we have for today and mind you i'm also going to be posting some useful ideas about intro about some editing you get what i'm trying to say we're going to be missing them anyway we're also going to be doing vlog you get what i'm trying to say so yeah also don't forget to follow me on my social handles my tiktok as safe a i'm going to put the description box below yeah so you don't need to bother yourself everything you need to know is going to be on the description so you just need to go there and check them out so guys i'm gonna see you in my next video and thank you for watching bye for now